Hello world, it's me, Dr. Reigns, and today I want to show you guys um, my strategy for beating the 10th floor of the Chaos Field. Uh, first, I would like to say that uh, the strategy for floors 1 to, I believe it's 6, it's pretty much the same. You only, the, the only variations uh, that you get are a little bit of stronger enemies, but uh, still you can get pretty much by, you can get by with pretty much uh, the same strategy, which uh, as you can see is basically three AoE attackers or three main attackers. Uh, it's better to be two AoE attackers and one, uh, what's it called, and one single target attacker. But uh, I also wanted to use only Chaos Relics available in the... It doesn't really matter anymore, but <laughs> I, I wanted to use uh, only Chaos Relics and characters available in the... What's it called? In the normal Chaos Zone, I think. Uh, that's why I went with OG Momonga, uh, Overlord Momonga, Evil Eye, and Stone Cutter Sebas. And well, obviously Clementine, because I need I, I need some healing. I think for this particular team, a better healer will be Mare. Uh, I don't remember his whole name, but uh, yeah, Mare, the AOE healer. Um, I also, yeah, it's it's because of the of the way targeting works. Uh, you, you, with this particular team, usually the characters won't attack the same. Usually the enemies won't attack the same uh, the same ally, the same character. Uh, that many times in a row, so it's better to use an AoE healer, in my opinion, at least. But uh, my Mara is just like level 80 or something. Uh, I still haven't been broken. His abilities are level 1 or something. I don't know. It's I just prefer to use Clementine because she's just very maxed out. And so is every 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 other character. Yeah, so so are my, my Chaos Relics. Uh, I have. I have Symbol of the Guild for Momonga, uh, Lord Momonga for Clementine, and. I don't remember the, the other two, but uh, I think I think for for Sebas I went with Mighty Warrior, and for Clement uh, for Clement and for Evil Eye I went with something like uh, I don't know something that gave her speed. I don't really exactly remember. It's probably a fight to be first wife. Uh, I, I I already forgot that. <clears throat> but yeah, as you can see, it's it's really easy. Just just uh, use the AOE attack with uh, the three attackers. And <laughs> pretty much everyone dies. It's it's really not not much of an issue. Not not much of an issue. Uh, if someone gets low in HP, just yeah. If someone gets low in HP, just uh, it's usually gonna be Momonga. But if someone ends up getting low in HP, use uh, Clementine to heal them. Or if other if someone other than no 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 if. At least more than one character is low in HP. Use uh, Clementine's Overdrive. You should have charge. You should have it charged by now, uh, with my strategy at least. And yeah, well, Evil Eye is the only one not maxed out. I, I just realized uh, she's still missing like uh, two levels, two level ups, two more level ups, I think. And yeah, um, this is the this is level six, I believe. Yeah, level six. Uh, this is the this is the point, <laughs> I guess, where things start to change you start you start facing off against two uh boss characters <laughs> i don't know i don't know how to describe them but uh yeah it's usually it it was just one of up, up until now but uh over here you get uh well there are there are actually three i forgot uh this is level seven i think uh last one it's it there were two which i believe were Cositus and Aura? I could be wrong, but uh, they, let, let's just go with that. And over here we have three, which are Clementine. No, Clementine. Oh my God, I can't, I can't get, I can't get that girl out of my mind. Uh, yeah, we have three, which are uh, Shelter, Alberto, and the Mirhi. And well, uh, even if a character dies, it's not really much of an issue because you. Since Momonga has that much, <laughs> since Momonga has a lot of HP. Uh, you can usually get by with just having him and other other character alive, and you can still get other character other character alive and at full health. Uh, you can you can usually get by uh, having the Joe's just Momonga and another character alive with full health uh, to get the over fifty percent health uh, star to get your ten K stones, which 
Uh, I don't know if you realize or if you even care about that, but uh, we finally have the the old Chaos Field back. Uh, that, that means it's 60% more Chaos Stones because uh, last, last time or the, the last Chaos Field, uh, we only had, I believe, Chaos Stones for Chapter 5 and Chapter 10, I think, which, you know... Uh, chapter 5 gave you 10 Chaos Stones, Chapter 10 gave you 30, and that's 40, <laughs> obviously. Uh, yeah, and the, the old Chaos Field, or the new Chaos Field, which was the old Chaos Field, the OG Chaos Field, gave you 10 Chaos Stones for each individual individual chapter, I think, chapter, chapter, or... Chapter, or... <laughs> what's it called? Chapter, or... Story, I don't, I don't really know, but uh, yeah. Uh, which is a hundred instead of sixty instead of forty. That's sixty percent more. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I just run around. And yeah, this is the this is the last battle. The chaos the chaos field chaos field floor ten chapter ten story ten. I don't know. It's just it's the the last one of the of the OG floors before you get into the uh, type specific floors type specific uh, fields. I don't know. And level 10 is really interesting because at first you just fight some play 8, but not all of them. I, I believe the, the four that you end up fighting are randomized, but uh, I, could, I could be wrong about that. If they're not randomized, they're going to be the four other ones, which are Yuri, Lupusrojina, Solution, and... No, not Lupusrojina. No, no, yeah, not Real and Lupusrojina. Yeah, that's, that's it. <laughs> I ca I'm kind of I'm kind of a little bit behind of my Overlord lore, so don't judge me, please. <laughs> please, I need Strangers of Plural on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Other than that, uh, it's really it's really not much of an issue, not much different than the other chaos builds. It's still really it's still pretty easy if you have uh, four or five strong characters <laughs> maxed out, which chaos relics that are are also maxed out. Uh, uh, the type advantage doesn't come doesn't really come into play that much uh, in the in the early, in the er, in the er, ah doesn't really come doesn't really come at play that much in this level. Uh, they only come. They, don't, they only really come at play in the in the later ones, uh, the, the type specific ones. The power uh, power field, power chaos field type, <laughs> the, the the one for the one for the power type. That one is uh, what I believe really comes into play. And yeah, in chaos field ten, you end up fighting floor plates three. Uh, no, and all the floor guardians, I believe. Uh, the, it doesn't really, it doesn't really change much. As I already say, you just need to get prepared for Momonga. You know, probably have prefer preferably have uh, most of the characters overdrive. But if you don't, it's just not of much of an issue. Just use the use the usual uh, all three AOE attackers strat, and you can get and you can kill pretty much everyone except Momonga. Momonga is really sort of a tank, and you have to. That's what, this is why I prefer to have a, what's it called, a single target damage dealer instead of three AoE attackers. Uh, but alas, I, I don't think there's any good one for for the normal Chaos summon, so I, 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 again, I decided to go with these three, these, these three fellas. And yeah, Momonga is, Momonga can pose a little bit of a threat, but uh, with Clementine and her shielding prayer, the damage he deals is pretty, pretty small. Even if he he has uh, both dark strengths, which uh, I don't know why he seems to like, he seems to like to do that a lot. I don't again, I don't know, I don't have no idea why, but uh, that's better for us because that means each time each turn he does that, he is a turn. No, he, he, each time he does that, it's a turn that he's not attacking us, so that's great damage for us. Here we, can, here we go with Falling Down, which only deals 800 damage. I don't know why he has that much HP, especially because, yeah, the, he doesn't really deal that much that much damage, and he also doesn't really attack, attack that often. Uh, I have no idea why, but uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, I Evil Eye dealt the finishing blow, and that's it. Chaos, Chaos Field... Floor 10, Store 10, Chapter 10, whatever 10. Uh, I'll clear with only Chaos Summon, which on, with only base characters? I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> thank you so much for watching and see you guys later. Oh yeah, before we go, here is one summon. A pervy old man. Ciao, ciao.